Hi, I'm Sherlyn, and today I'm going to show you how to add horizontal content to your emails in Klaviyo. An email template in Klaviyo contains one or more sections that you can add or delete as needed. Within each section, there are three content blocks you can use to add horizontal content to your email. Split blocks, columns, and table blocks. Let's walk through how to use each content block. Say you want to create an email template to announce a limited stock product. You want to use a split block to add an image on one side and the corresponding text on the other side. By default, a split block will use a 50-50 split to display content in two columns of any width. If you need more space for the image or text, simply navigate to the Split Settings tab to adjust this ratio. Keep in mind, you're limited to text and image content in two columns. So what if you want to include a product image, text description, and the CTA button. You'll want to use columns to add any type of content to a block. Add up to four columns to your template, then drop content blocks into each column to populate it. You can add as many content blocks as you would like in a stacked or side-by-side -side format. So get creative. Add a button block underneath a product description or an image to direct customers to take action. Keep in mind, columns are limited to a handful of pre-selected column width options. In some cases, you may want to add content side by side with an unlimited number of columns and rows. For this, use a table block. Then, in the Table Settings tab, add additional rows and columns. Now, you can navigate back to the Content tab to configure the table's content. Table blocks auto space themselves, but you can also set a width in the Width Settings of the Columns tab. Here's where you can also choose to show column blocks on certain devices. Remember, your template will autosave throughout your editing session. If you make a mistake while editing your template, use the undo button to revert it. You can also use the redo button to reverse that change. Then, use the preview and test button to preview how your email will appear in a recipient's inbox. Now it's your turn to use the appropriate blogs to add content to your emails based on your own marketing needs.